Good evening. I hope you are all comfortable, feeling well. But just how well are you feeling? Hoping to live a long life? Well, we hope so too. Then just consider this. This graph shows a huge increase in deaths due to cancer in the developed world toward the end of the 19th century. A dramatic increase, wouldn't you say? Well then, why? Who was responsible for this monumental increase in cancer deaths? It was engineers. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, engineers were the culprits. It was engineers who designed and built sewer and sanitation systems in cities all around the world. After the great stink of London in 1858, sewer systems were built in ever increasing numbers so that instead of people dying from waterborne diseases such as cholera or typhoid, people were living much longer. Long enough so that they had a much greater chance of dying from cancer. Some say that engineers have saved more lives than doctors. But all of this happened over a hundred years ago. So how do engineers impact upon our lives today? Wherever you are right now, chances are you got there by road. Maybe even in a car. And you got there safely because of the work of engineers. Grade separated intersections such as this help prevent road crashes from occurring. This was designed by a civil engineer. And if a crash does occur, a crash barrier such as this, designed by a structural engineer, can minimise the damage. And an airbag, ABS brakes or crumple zones, designed by a mechanical engineer, can minimise injury. And what about keeping you safe in your home? The safety switch in your home that minimises the chance of electrocution or fire if something goes wrong was designed by an electrical engineer. When was the last time you or your family got sick from food that had gone off? Not very likely. Why? It's engineers again. It was they who came up with refrigeration. And just who is responsible for all of these things that make the world a safer place? It's engineers. Like me. 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 So, if you want to help people to have the opportunity to die of a first world disease like cancer or heart disease, think about becoming an engineer today.